Well, today we're going to be repainting uh, a Game of Thrones Eagle Moss figure. So, uh, my wife and I have been re watching Game of Thrones. We've got up to season five at the moment, sort of binge watching it. And because the last season was so utterly awful, uh, you tend to forget that up till about season six, halfway through season seven, it was actually probably some of the best television ever made. And one of my favourite characters is Sandor Clegane, the Hound, who is just amazingly well acted, a likeable, absolute horrible person. Um, so, sent off one of these Eagle Moss figures. Um, you can pick these up dirt cheap on eBay now. Um, Eagle Moss has just gone into liquidation, so we're not going to be making any more. Um, Normally these are pretty good sculpts. I've got a few that I've repainted before um, Which we will have a look at but we're going to repaint this one. I thought I'd try and strip some of the paint off But look at just before we do that Look at that. It's more like Bruce Forsyth. Good game. Good game. It's not a good paint job I do like the fact that he's sort of famous for having half his face burnt and all they've done is like a bit of rouge but they've left his eyebrow on which isn't moulded on because he hasn't got one, it's been burnt off, but they've painted it on. So it looks really weird. Um, the sword's a bit bent, I'll have to try and do something with that. The paint job's not horrible for these figures, normally they're worse than this, but it's not great, I mean, it's all coming apart. So what I'm going to do is try and strip this off, so I'm going to see if my normal thinners will take it off. If it doesn't come off, I'll just spray it. And we'll redo it but uh, let's have a look see if uh, the paint will come off Okay, so I've primed him with Mr. Surface Primer. Um, so it's come out quite well. It's not a bad likeness. Some good detail on it. So I think we're going to start painting. So the first thing, I'm going to do the flesh. And I'm going to use uh, Army Painter Speed Paints for this, I think. They work very well for flesh. I've just got to get one out. I'm just going to use Crusader Skin. Which sounds lovely. It does need a little bit of work on top for this sort of scale figures, I think. I think it might be a little bit dark <coughs> on its own. We'll see how it goes. Okay, so. I'm starting his face, so I'm going to dry brush a little bit of red to show his burns. Just to bring it out a little bit. While that's drying, we're going to paint all his armour matte black, ready for dry brushing with a metallic finish. So you can go all over his armour and his leather tunic. Okay, so I've painted him all in black, all his armour, it's just drying. 
once that's completely dry, it has to be totally 100% dry, we can uh, do a bit of dry brushing. So what I'm going to do now is pick out his teeth. And then what else we're going to do is I... It's very hot here today, so the paint's drying really quickly. Okay, not too bad. So we're going to do a bit of dry brushing. So I'm going to use lead belcher. So you can see the way that brings out the armour. So I'm going to do that all over the armoured bits. Okay, so I've finished painting him. As you can see, it's a much better likeness to the actor than the original sort of Bruce Forsyth paint job. Um, I might dirty it down slightly more, he's a little bit clean. Um, but yeah, so I've painted his sigil on the base. I'll just get a little bit of black there, I'll take that off. Um, put some mud on his boots, um, dry brushed him a little bit all over. Didn't want too much because it's uh, he's meant to be quite a dirty character. Um, a little bit of dry brushing on the hair. I might put a little bit of gloss varnish on it because he has got quite greasy hair. But uh, overall, these figures are great fun to paint. I've forgotten how much fun they are, so I'm going to try and get some more uh, now that they're cheap. Because if the uh, new prequel series is a success, all the merchandise will go back up. If it's a failure, you can probably disappear forever. But yeah, so he can finally face off against Jon Snow. Hey. But uh, yeah, I enjoyed that one. Um, if you want to see more of these Eagle Moss figures, let me know. I've got a few of the other series like uh, Doctor Who and Alien that I haven't paint painted yet. Um, but uh, please like and subscribe if you can. Uh, please visit our Patreon uh, if you want to help support the channel going forwards. And uh, thanks for watching. See you again next time. Thanks then. Bye.